Hello and welcome to a new Animal Wise video. Today we want to talk about teacup dogs due to the rise in popularity of this type of dog among potential dog owners and breeders. Keep on watching if you want to know everything about these pets that can fit in the palm of your hand. What are teacup dogs? A teacup dog can come in different breeds and bloodlines, but what defines them as such is their size and weight. A teacup dog weighs no more than 4 pounds and should be less than 17 inches in height by the time they are adult dogs, although these measures have not been standardised. In order to achieve a teacup dog, breeders make the smallest dogs from a litter with other small dogs until genetic modification of small dog breeding achieves this desired size. The purely economic purpose of this breeding and the fact that this also poses health risks makes us dig in deeper in the reasons why it's not advisable or ethical to purchase a teacup dog. The most popular breeds of teacup dogs are Yorkshire Terriers, Spaniels, Chihuahuas, Dachshunds, Beagles, Pugs and Poodles although there are many other breeds that have been inbred as teacup dogs. How long do they live? General inbreeding can highly reduce a dog's lifespan. In the case of inbred teacup dogs, their lifespan would be similar to their normal sized breed version, but due to health risks and psychological issues, their lifespan can be decreased severely, even though small dog breeds have a higher lifespan than their bigger counterparts. Health problems in teacup dogs The severe breeding techniques breeders use makes teacup dogs even more prone to suffering many health issues that can lead these puppies to have a quite miserable life. Most of the health issues in teacup dogs are related to genetic factors. The most common are hypoglycemia, heart defects, collapsing trachea, seizures, breathing issues such as dyspnea and tachypnea, digestive problems, liver shunts, gum disease, patella luxation, hydrocephalus, weak bones. Teacup dogs also suffer from several psychological issues that are directly related to their size and breeding process. Chronic stress, behavioral issues such as Napoleon syndrome, learning difficulties, Breeding teacup dogs. The problems with their health are mainly due to harsh breeding techniques, which have been triggered by a higher demand of this type of dogs as their popularity has risen in recent years. The fact is that many people do not have appropriate licenses to breed in optimal conditions, as many have been proven to have been bred in intensive breeding farms with hardly any sanitary conditions. Moreover, Breeding mothers are impregnated both at the end and at the beginning of her cycle, which means they may be born prematurely, causing even further problems. Once they are born, puppies face malnutrition and are sold before their eight weeks of life, which is the time they need to spend next to their mother. All of this causes many of the puppies to die of several deformities and illnesses before they are even sold. How to care for a teacup dog As you've been able to see, the many issues that can arise in a teacup dog means you will need to take special care of them if you have adopted a teacup dog. Pay special attention to the following tips to care for them. Teacup dog diet To avoid hypoglycemia, teacup dogs should eat 3 to 4 times a day or roughly every 3 to 4 hours. Apart from giving them a feed that's adequate to their characteristics, also add caro syrup to their meals to prevent low blood sugar levels. Enrich their diet with food full of omega-3 fatty acids, minerals and vitamins. Reduce stressful situations. It's highly important to make sure your dog does not undergo stressful situations. In order to do so, create a routine with your dog Pay special attention to them and play for short periods of time. Teacup dogs need 14 hours sleep, so make sure you help them release their energy, but in small doses so they don't overwork their little body. It is not advisable to take them with you everywhere, 
especially if you live in the city or are going to places that the dog is not used to visiting, as all the stimuli appearing around them may create anxiety in the dog. Create a comfortable environment for your dog at home. Veterinary care. Under any of the symptoms mentioned before, you should take your dog to the vet immediately. Veterinary bills tend to be high in the case of teacup dogs due to the amount of times they may have to be treated throughout their lives. This is all from Animal Wise. We hope this video was useful to learn more about teacup dogs. Like if you enjoyed this video and share to create awareness on the truth about teacup dogs. See you soon! Thank you.